it's Agnes. I've got another viewer request. It's from, from RJ. You asked about the law of transmutation or transmuting of energy. Okay, so uh, the power to change conditions in people's lives. That's what it is about, transforming your low vibrations into a high vibration. So therefore, the conditions that are out there change and you get something different in your life and what surrounds you 3d okay so you're transmuting really your negative vibes or your bad vibes or your where you have doubt you don't believe where you feel you're not good enough where you feel that you know you're unloved unwanted or that you can't be successful or any of those negative sort of things that you've got going on that you've accumulated through your family belief systems and also then you've gone on to school or to church or you know to any kind of where you were with people a lot regularly as you were growing up that's where you collected your beliefs started with your caregivers those that raised you and then it went out over time so the law of transmutation is where you're changing your energy from negative energy which is you thinking about negative things and then you feel the emotions of your negative thinking you always start with a thought then it becomes a dominant thought one that you think of a lot and then that dominant thought becomes a belief and then that generates feelings in your body okay so you can definitely change the energy within you. You can definitely change the thoughts within your own mind. You can change the feelings within your own body. Once you understand how all this stuff works, which we talk a lot about on this channel and, you know, there's lots of other people that talk about it as well, but you are actually changing your whole energy that goes out from you. And then what happens is, as those of you that have been watching this channel for a while, you know that what goes out from you as a projection and pro when you say, this is actually a good question that you've brought up here about this, because when you say you're projecting something, projection, I'm going to break down the mechanics of what projection is. You're actually projecting your thoughts forward. You're projecting the feeling that you've got to go with it. Okay. So it's an energy from your mind, it's an energy from your body and they kind of go together and they do this and then they go out. So that's the kind of basic mechanics of how it works and then what happens is that energy, whether you're in something really negative and you know nothing about the law of attraction, the law of projection at all, you're just living your life as you always have and then you're just getting what you get and then you've got complaining to do because everything in front of you is not very good. Um, or those of you that are conscious creators understand the laws of attraction, projection, assumption, cause and effect, you know, all these different laws that, that you've read about and that I've talked about on this channel you then are able to harness that and direct it and become uh, a selector of conscious creator, as we talk about, conscious selector, meaning you select what goes out from you as a projection so that you are then more able to create those things that you want out there rather than just getting a random bag of mixed nuts which you don't really want and then you have to spend time complaining or trying to get out of it or you know going to the hospital because you've created an illness or you've created a job loss or you've got no money you've got debt whatever it is whatever negative condition you've created but the great thing is once you understand conscious creation and you understand you can change things through this case um, with RJ's question, the law of transmutation, trans, getting all excited and tongue-tied, changing your negative energy and vibe into a conscious selecting of a positive energy and vibe, therefore you can then influence what is around you. Now what I find really interesting is, you know, people will say and, and you can observe this this week as you move around after listening to this YouTube you know people will say oh you know I really believe you know this like that um, 
uh, I really believe that I'm a good person and that, you know, I can um, have a really good job. And yet what you witness around them is they don't have any money and they don't, they've got part-time jobs with people that don't pay them properly. So really it's not the words that you listen to, it's you look at what they've got around them and that will tell you what they really, really believe. And that can be someone that you know extremely well or it can be someone that you have a conversation with, you know, at work or whatever that you don't know extremely well, but you can see the conditions. The conditions will always, always, always tell you what people believe. And it doesn't lie. It's 100% accurate. It works perfect, perfectly. So sometimes the words people say will not match what results they've actually had. Okay. But of course, as you become a conscious creator, you can start changing your words, changing your internals. Hopefully you'll keep it to yourself until it's hatched because it's better to keep things private so that no one can stick their fingers in it and ruin it for you. And then you've got to try and defend, which is a total waste of time and energy. So yeah, so that was a really good question, RJ. And I hope um, that, you know, you you can change whatever conditions you've got going on, not just you, RJ, but anybody else listening to this change any conditions that are not to your liking (laughs) which is why we're here on YouTube (laughs) lots of love and um, thank you for asking about this isn't a law that we talk about that much so yeah I really like you know I always think of a snake you know how it, it 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 sheds its skin and it goes from being the snake before to the snake after it's like it changes it transmutes and becomes the thing with the new skin and that's basically what we're doing we're shedding the old and then becoming the thing with the new skin and the new skin is the new knowledge of conscious creating and all the laws and self-love and you know just you knowing what you're doing projection wise law of attraction wise assuming all that stuff lots of love to you guys